Hello and welcome to UM News. I'm Griffin Rirucca. UM and a local company are teaming up at Grizz football games to try to lower DUI rates, which are the third highest in the country. I talked with the co-founder of the DUI prevention company, Think Twice, with the goal of alcohol education. Tests. These tests use the same breathalyzers the police use. Mackay says his goal is to educate people about blood alcohol levels before they get a DUI. People don't necessarily understand what the legal limit to drive means. 0 0.08 is the legal limit to drive is very confusing for people. Most people never get the chance to blow into a breathalyzer until they run into a law enforcement officer. Mackay says when people take his test, they will have a better idea for what 0 0.08 means. After Gabby G took the breathalyzer, she felt it was an awakening experience. But it's good to know that perhaps another few sips would have put me over the line. Um, and I should be hyper aware of that. Another goal of Think Twice is to make blood alcohol testing more available in establishments that serve alcohol. That way they could better monitor alcohol consumption and maybe even take keys away or cut people off. Mackay says DUIs are a risk to both the establishment and the consumer. Our primary focus is to work with bars, restaurants, nightclubs, stadiums. Anybody who sells alcohol to the public has inherently a risk. There's a risk to their business if they break the law, they overserve somebody, and that individual gets hurt on the way home, the bartender, the bar can be sued. It's called liquor liability. Think Twice currently has their breathalyzers in eight establishments in Missoula. Breathalyzers will be available at the Think Twice booth every home game. UM is also looking at the effects of seasonal affective disorder. A local study showed that a number of students who reported feeling very sad increased by more than 8% between summer and winter of 2018. Counselors at the Curry Health Center say that the seasonal affective disorder, or SAD, describes a pattern of depressive symptoms during the fall or winter. One way to deal with SAD is by using light therapy, also known as happy lamps. UM student Abby Nordstrom says her happy lamp helped her through her first Missoula winter. When I moved here, uh, I kind of thought that all of my stress would be coming from school and being away from my family, but then when the weather turned out to have such a big impact on my mental health, and it kind of took me off guard and took me a while to figure out how to manage it. Happy lamps are available for rent at the Curry Health Center. Thanks for watching UM News. Have a great day.